My name is Eugene Panrudkovich. I'm the owner of Screen Surgeons, a laptop computer screen replacement service in Tucson, Arizona. Uh, customers ship their laptops to us from all over the country to get screens replaced and they often ask how to package their laptop for shipping. The easiest way is to go to a UPS store or a FedEx store or a shipping and packaging store and have them do it for you. It'll cost you about $40. If you want to save some money, about $20 to $25, you can package the laptop yourself fairly easily. So you just need some basic packaging supplies and nothing more. Let's start with small laptops. For a small laptop, I mean one that has a screen size of 14 inches or less. The post office provides boxes that you can do it pretty conveniently. The two boxes you need are it's called a medium flat rate shipping box. And it's, the other one is just called a mailing box. At the post office, you have several sizes of priority mail mailing box. Find one that's about the same size as the medium flat rate box. The first step you do is put the boxes together and put the mailing box inside the medium flat rate box. You might have to force it a little bit, but it will go in fairly easily like this. So now you have a double box and these boxes are free at the post office. Now the next thing you do is you need to wrap the laptop. Whenever you ship a laptop you have two layers of packaging. One is the wrapping material, that's the one you wrap the laptop with, and the other one is the padding material. So let's look at some wrapping materials. The easiest one, and probably the best one of course, is the bubble wrap, which you can get at any shipping store. You want the bubble wrap with the small bubbles. If you don't have bubble wrap, you can use a paper towel to wrap the laptop. You can use a kitchen towel, I've seen that work before, to wrap the laptop. Or if you're really out of options, just use a newspaper to wrap the laptop. Okay, for this case, we're going to use bubble wrap to wrap the laptop. So, this is very simple. What you do is wrap the laptop with bubble wrap, like so. Use some packaging tape. The ends. Like so. And put it inside the box. Now, you'll notice that the laptop, the wrapped laptop, is still wiggles around in there. So that's where the padding material comes in. For that, the easiest thing to do is crumple some newspaper, however many sheets you need, close the box, and you're ready to go. So, this kind of box you can ship for $11.50. 11.50 from anywhere in the country with delivery confirmation. Please make sure you have delivery confirmation for your records. Now for larger laptops, it's a little bit more difficult because there's no flat rate box for priority. So this is a 17 inch laptop. For this kind of laptop, you go to the post office and buy a ready post box. The size of this box is 20 inch by 14 inch by 10 inch. So, like before, we want to wrap the laptop. And this, this time, I'm going to use paper towels. Make 
make sure you use a lot to get good padding and make sure you get, have the thick paper towels. Okay, I'm going to stop right here wrapping with paper towels, but if you were to do it yourself, I use two or three times as much. You tape the end. like so, and then you prepare the big box. So, the other part is the padding material. So a box this big, you might end up using a whole newspaper. So what you do, a whole newspaper, Used a little bit, but in your case, you probably use a whole newspaper. Put the laptop in, crumple newspaper around the sides, crumple more newspaper until the box is filled up, then close it up and ship it. So this box is about 350 at the post office, and if you use just regular airmail for this, it'll cost you about 15 to 20 dollars. Once again, please make sure you use delivery confirmation. And um, that's it, and that's how you package your laptop.